All right, what is up, you guys? I know it's been <laughs> forever since I posted a video. Probably asking, where have you been? Why are you posting new videos? Well, two weeks ago, my laptop basically froze on me over the weekend. It just had some kind of technical problems where it basically freezing, but my computer entirely froze the weekend before last. So I took it to my campus ITS to try and get it to them to fix it. Um, they took out the malware, updated the drivers, but um, not really a lot was done. It kind of got it to where like I'm able to work and be able to function if it does freeze up again, but I'm usually kind of doing the on and off with my home screen. So basically my laptop has to go to Best Buy when I go back home for Thanksgiving, either that or I have to put a new laptop on my Christmas list. And this laptop has been with me for almost three years, so, and as you know, I do most of my video shooting, most of my editing and my uploading through my main laptop. I've done a couple through my phone, but that takes up a lot of space with my phone, like, storage, so hopefully we'll get this figured out by the end of the year. I'm also working on getting, wire, like, I know a lot of people have been using them it's, and got them as these headphones where you're able to hear but you can hear the full volume so it won't get copyrighted by YouTube. I'm working on getting those probably by beginning mid-December. So that way, beginning of the year, we can start off fresh with a new setting. Um, we've got to 100 subscribers. Thank you guys so much for your support and following my channel. I love you guys' comments. You guys are amazing. I wanted to get to 100 subscribers by the end of the year, and it's November it got to 100 November 12th yesterday, and I'm so happy. I would love to see the channel grow. Um, my goal for probably next year would probably get to, I know it's big, but 1,000. Let's hopefully get there. And the reason why we're, we're there is because you guys collaborate with the content. You guys give me the ideas, which is amazing. You guys are the best, and it's a blessing. And now I'm going to get to the regular schedule programming. We're here for a reaction, and today we're going to be reacting to the Havana remix with Daddy Yankee. Y'all, I've been waiting for this for weeks, and when it dropped on, um, it dropped yesterday because I watched Premier's performance on EMAs, I was just like, okay, I cannot listen to this song. I gotta wait till I get my laptop back, faithfully to give it back to me today, so I'm able to react with you guys. So we are going to do reaction to Havana remix with night with daddy Aki. the volume might be toned differently because of copyright so you may have to hear the same volume i do kind of in a higher sound so let's go so this version is kind of like sped up so you still got the same tone Okay, it's Spanish version. Okay. Alright. I feel like they did the, the Spanish version remix with Daddy Yankee. So that makes a lot of sense. It makes sense. I love this song. I feel like she's gonna get a Grammy, guys. I'm so proud of her. And she's gonna get that Grammy nomination. I'm not gonna lie. Well, she already got the Latin Grammy nomination. She will get the American Grammy nomination. I feel like Daddy Yankee is going to take Young Fuck's spot. Maybe? I'm not sure. Let's just keep listening. Okay. Oh! Okay! Okay! <laughs> like this! Okay. He got a spin on it. Okay, he got a spin on it. Okay. Okay, I like this. Okay. I like this. I like that they did the Spanish remix to this. I like it. Even though I've heard Daddy Yankee with English and Spanish, I like the Spanish more. Okay. Alright. He has more lyrics than Young Thug did in the song. Wow. Okay. This song's gonna be so popular. Oh my goodness. This is 
This is honestly her best song. The album's not even out yet. And this is the best song on there. That is just so good. My goodness. Yes. So right now, the song has about 3.9 million views on YouTube since yesterday. And that's in a day. Y'all, that's probably... That's awesome. And honestly, I feel like it's going to gain the same like, success as... Not as like the original Havana, but it feels going to get like way more. Because you have Daddy Yankee. He's coming off of Despacito and Boom Boom with Red One. Bruh, this was a great move for management team. Camille, Camille is making bands, y'all. She's making them bands. I'm so proud of her. Honestly, she has come up. She was blessed with the luck of something, my goodness, because she's come off for a solo artist, coming off of a group that was successful, to go on her own. That is amazing. I feel like she's the Jennifer Lopez of our generation, but a lot of people say, no, she's the Camila of our generation, so she's starting out. Honestly, I love the song. I cannot wait for this album to come out. As far as we know, the album's coming out in January. Originally, it's supposed to be September, but then they were like, oh no, Fifth Harmony's album comes out at the end of August, so we're going to move it to November. No, October was coming around, it was like, oh no, we're moving to January. I feel like we're moving to January to add these bonus tracks, including the remixes, and maybe a couple more. Hopefully the next music video will be OMG, so I'm just excited for this album. And it's two months away. I'm just excited. Let me all let me let me know what y'all think of the reactions. Let me know what you guys want me to react to since I missed basically a whole week and a half of stuff. Let me know in the comments. Remember to subscribe to the channel. Peace out. More love and peace out guys.